Content marketing is not a new phenomenon. It's something that's been important in the market for many, many years. But nowadays, marketers have better data, they have more knowledge and more insights into their buyers and how to help them really expand and grow their professional business. But at that also comes a cost. It also means that you have to connect with the right buyer at the right place at the right time. Now, with more people being involved in the buyer's journey, it can sometimes seem complex, overwhelming, and daunting. But with over 50,000 videos and webinars on Bright Talk, where professionals are educating themselves every day, we've learned what it takes to make successful content and to really help nurture and drive revenue. So everyone tries to figure out what is the best time, the best format, the best length to really drive revenue? People are engaging with content in a lot of different places, and so there's really not one specific type of content that is the best. The best type of content is when you really repurpose, reformat, and engage with the content in different places. So you take one mainstream idea and you figure out, okay, I have a large webinar that is really the meat of what I'm trying to sell. It touches those main points, really connects with the buyer. But then I can take that webinar and I can turn it into six blog posts. I can turn it into a couple podcasts. I can turn it into three infographics. And that is what is successful. Those drip campaigns and those assets from those one single piece of content will help you engage with different buyers at different stages in the journey. Across the board, what people are looking for is just a variety of formats that really provide educational value. It's about connecting with them the way they want, when they want it. We live in an on-demand world, and so making sure that you have rich content that is available and accessible at any time is crucial to the success of your business. Statistically, if you look across Demand Gen Report, Content Marketing Institute, um, several others, all of them are ranking webinars and videos as some of the top most successful types of content format. So they're really providing ways that provide a human element to your brand, to your product, and to your services. Buyers are researching on a continuous cycle throughout the day. They're looking at their email, they're searching on Google, they're going on to Bright Talk to watch a webinar. They're really looking for the solutions to help them solve their business problems. And it's really your objective as a marketer to get your product and your solutions in front of their minds while they're solving those problems. It used to be that you would market just the C-suite or perhaps the VP level. But nowadays, those tasks of researching what solutions are the best are kind of passed down. So junior level and you know management positions are now doing a lot of the researching and then presenting the information. So you need to make sure that your solutions and your content is in front of all of those purchasing decision makers and really make sure that it resonates with all of them to see the best success. There's a lot of noise out there, there's a lot of content, and there are a lot of solutions in your market. Now, in order to really stay at the front of the mind of your potential customers, you have to have viewers and you have to have engagement with your content to really drive revenue. It's those that educate, engage, and create that brand loyalty, and then leverage that brand loyalty to drive revenue that see the most success. People are looking to understand how-tos, introductions, how to get ahead in their market. So anything that can really help them advance their career is a topic that will resonate well with them. Figure out what that is and then solve how your business problems really fit into that picture. And by marrying those two, you'll have successful content. Your content should really be targeted towards your best buyer. It's the people who really will connect best with your solutions, and then you turn that into content. You find out what they're trying to solve and what they're looking to learn, and you create content that addresses that. But really make sure that you're targeting a specific group of people within the industry, whether it's a buyer persona or not, because that's where you'll see the best ROI within your content marketing. The most important part of content creation is truly understanding your buyer. Understanding what they want to learn, what their problems are, and how they prefer to consume. Now once you've done that, you'll be able to create a story, find data, and find information that really resonates with them to create an engaging relationship. You'll be able to pepper in your solution along the way that seamlessly plants the seeds for a future customer. Content is educational, it is informative, it is powerful, and it is what helps connect you with your best prospects.